What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, guys? It's your boy Tay, and today we made some money, baby. And that's what it's about. That's what it's about. And we are also going to do a giveaway on this video. And then we are going to reveal the winner for the last giveaway that we did. In one of my previous videos, I said I was going to give away a $25 gift card to one of you guys or one of my merch shirts. And I'm going to actually let you decide. But you're going to have to reach out to me like soon and let me know which one you want. Whoever happens to win. But without further ado, I just want to say that we made some pretty decent sales. And it seems like eBay is picking up, baby. And that's what it's about. We need eBay to pick up, especially going into the fall, which we know is Q3, Q4, the best time of the year for all resellers. So make sure that we're going out there and doing all the sourcing that we can now and getting all the items because this is the time of the year that people buy everything, everything. So that's the best. That's the best. And the beauty about it is... You can do it on your own time. That's the best thing about becoming a reseller. Like we can work our own hours. It is 1036 right now and I have pajama pants on. <laughs> I can't go to work in pajama pants, but I can right now as a reseller, you know, and it is what it is, you know, um, just because I'm in pajamas don't mean I'm lazy. It just means I like comfort. And that's the best thing about becoming a reseller. Besides the profits, I mean, yeah, I mean, definitely the profits too. And for some of you who don't know, um, I was just on this TV show that just premiered this past Thursday called 60 Days In, and I was actually gifted some items for our premiere party that we had. And these are a bunch of these pictures with me starting now 60 Days In. So what I want to do on one of these giveaways is I want to send somebody one of these cards. I want to send you one and I'm going to sign it. And yeah, I mean, so you can have a little piece of history with me being on 60 days in. And I think it's crazy anyway. So yeah, I'm going to give one of those away and I'm going to tell you how here in a little bit. But first, I want to show you some of the items that we got sold over this past few days. And yeah, let's check them out. First thing that we sold is going to be this Armored Core Xbox 360 game. I got this game for $2 at the 127 sales at somebody's house and they actually paid 30 bucks for this item they actually paid 38 dollars and 88 cents total it's cool i can see all the fees and everything but it's going to cost me like around five dollars to ship this item out so when it's all said and done i'm going to profit well over 25 dollars on this item after the fees and everything which is pretty good considering we only have two dollars into it next thing we sold are going to be these centicles that we grabbed from lowe's what we went to lowe's and i think it was like january yes because it was after christmas so yeah, we went to Lowe's, saw these on the clearance. We paid a dollar for each one of these. I just sold a three pack for $16.74, which means we have $3 into them if I paid $3 a piece. So after the fees and everything, I'm probably only gonna profit like around $12 because they paid me $24 total. And I'll make a little bit, little bit of money off of the shipping because this is gonna be a first class item. So yeah, like I said, when it's all said and done, I should profit probably like around 12 bucks. Mm, not too bad. Next thing is going to be these plates that we have in here that are already wrapped up because as soon as I get plates, I go ahead and wrap them bad boys up as best as I can. But we sold a four pack of plates, four salad plates actually, for a total of, I took an offer of 20 bucks. So they paid me $37, including shipping and everything. And it actually didn't cost me that much to get it shipped out. So when it's all said and done, it's pretty much all profit because I've made so much money on these plates that it's ridiculous. I bought all the plates for $9.99 and it was probably like 30 plates and I've sold so many different sets of those plates that it's like I said, it's not even funny. So this is going to be completely all profit when it's all said and done. So we should profit like around that $23, $24 mark when it's all, so yeah, yeah, when it's all said and done. And I know you're like, well, if they paid $20 and then it's $37 total, how are you making $20? Because again, like I said, it's all free for me because I'm already in the profit. And then after the fees, it'd be like around 22 bucks. You guys remember when I got this bear? I mean, I remember when I got him, but I don't remember when I got him. Does that make sense? Like, I remember picking him up. I believe I got him from like a Goodwill for like three or four bucks. Oh, what do you know? Boom, look, the sticker's still on there. <laughs> I am so glad I flipped this bad boy around because I had this in the box almost already packed. If you can see, like, it's right here. It was already packed, so I'm so glad I just 
I just did that. So now I can take the sticker off. So yeah, we paid $3.99 for it. And somebody paid me $16.42 for it. And after the fees and everything, if we paid four bucks for it, we're probably profit like around $10 after this all said and done because they paid me like 27 total. And this is really, really light to ship. So next we sold a three pack of water filters. I've had these filters for probably over a year. I'm not even gonna lie. I got a bunch of filler fillers i got a bunch of filters on a fill a bag day and that's when you fill a bag up for like 20 bucks at that time and i had a bunch of them so and these are like the first sets to ever sell it's kind of crazy i normally i would have donated them or thrown them away by now but i wanted to make some kind of profit off of them and i'm glad i did and i'm glad i held out because somebody paid me 18 dollars 88 cents and for fill a bag days for me that means it's pretty much gonna be all profit because we've already made our money back on any fill a bag day i promise you that probably times like one million <laughs> not a million because if it was i'd be a millionaire but we definitely made our money back so when it's all said and done i'm definitely probably gonna profit like around 15 bucks on those filters the next thing we sold is gonna be this easton red line bat when i found this bat i said in that video that this bat was going to sell super quick now the problem is i don't know if that video came out yet because your boy's behind on editing i'm not even gonna lie i'm way behind on editing a lot has been going on if you can't tell your boy has been on 60 days in <laughs> so yeah we just have a lot going on over here and i'm gonna catch up on all my videos soon but this bat in that video just listen to the words when i'm like this bat is gonna sell super quick and it did. This bat sold for $55.55 and the buyer paid me $27 and some change to get it shipped. So they paid me a total of $90.36 for this bat that I paid $2 for. Yeah, so it's just crazy how inexpensive you can find these bats for and then the profit that you can make off of them. So yeah, this nice bat two dollars into it i'm gonna make well over probably 60 something dollars because it only cost me nine dollars to get this bat shipped because i'm shipping it ups and not usps even though they paid usps i'm shipping it out like two days earlier than i'm supposed to so it'd get to them earlier than it's supposed to so therefore it'd be priority to them kind of sort of although it's going to be in a whole other company but still at the end of the day i do change i go for the cheapest shipping all the time i don't care they pay me priority <laughs> and I can find it cheaper on UPS. I usually do that. I've been doing that since I've started eBay and I have never, ever gotten a complaint. But the majority of the time I do that, I ship out early. So if I was supposed to ship out on a Friday, I'm probably shipping out on a Tuesday or a Wednesday or something like that. So they're going to get their item early. Nice profits on the bat though. Then these next few items I am definitely proud of because, again, this is another video that I'm editing right now. Actually, I'm in the middle of editing this video that will come out. So it'll, probably, it'll be the next video that comes out after this one. Um, but this right here, I found a bunch of these books at one yard sale, like a bunch of books. She gave me a deal. I paid 10 bucks for a bunch of books, $10 for a bunch of books. I'm not going to spoil it because I want you to see the video, but I paid $10 for a bunch of books. And... This book right here, so it, in essence, we have 50 cents in all the books. I can say that. So yeah, I just told you how many books we bought, 20. <laughs> so we have 50 cents in each book that we bought. And somebody paid me $12.12 .12 for this book right here, $18 total. That means with shipping and everything included, media mail items get shipped only for like three or four bucks, which is incredible. So when it's all said and done, I'm probably only gonna profit like around maybe like 10 to $11 on this item. But it's good when we got 50 cents into it. Then we have another set of books that we have sold, the economic books. Um, these sold for $18.99. They paid me a total of $24.28 after they paid shipping and everything like that. So when it's all said and done, I should profit probably 15 bucks or so, maybe a little bit more. I'm not considering all the fees, but yeah, I should profit like around 15 bucks off of this. I mean, I got 50 cents into both of them, or actually a dollar. I got a dollar into both of these books. Because 50 cents, 50 cents, that's a dollar. <laughs> And then this book I purchased when I bought a pallet last year and I've already made my money on that pallet. I've actually made a few thousand dollars off that pallet. And this book was in there and somebody paid me $5 for this book. They paid me a total of $9.43. In essence, this book was like pennies to me because it came a part of a pallet. So it probably had like three, four pennies into this item. And I know it's only a $5 sale, but I'm gonna go profit $4. <laughs> Okay, guys, I hear my baby crying, so um, let's go ahead and end this video. <laughs>
<laughs> but before I do, and if you would like to win one of these starting now prison to profit portraits, I will sign it. Um, if you want to win that, just leave a comment in the video. That's pretty much all you got to do. Just leave a comment in the video. Um, nothing in particular. Just leave whatever kind of comment that you want to leave. And I will randomly select a winner from that video to win. And as far as the last video that we had, and I said a $25 gift card, we're going to go ahead and do that now. So let's go ahead and go to the computer and so we can find out who that winner is. So this is the video that we are going to pick a winner from. We're going to just go ahead and choose from all comments and hope somebody said I made it this far. Anika D, I made it this far. Congrats on the great deal on the hat. Ask and you shall receive. That is correct. Anika D, you are the winner. Anika D, make sure that you send me a message on Instagram if you have Instagram. And I may make you change this comment to something else just to make sure that I can verify that you are the winner. But congratulations, Anika D. Congratulations again. And thank you guys so much for watching the channel, being a part of this channel. And just like, just blessing me, man. You guys, you bless me on a regular basis. You really, really do. And you guys don't even know it. So just thank you for that. And yeah, so, but for now, I got to go get these to the post office and I need to go make sure that I go bless somebody because I know you can go bless somebody. So yeah, let's, let's just, let's just go do that. So yeah, yeah. You go bless somebody today. I'm gonna bless somebody tomorrow. And at this point in time, your boy Tay, I'm out.